Ranvi. Our work is done in Oxenifordshire, but the cost has been high. I feared as much when this letter arrived, from one called Fulke, addressed to you. From Fulke? Gods, that witch! It is there on the table. Fulke is with the Order of the Ancients. The same order Kyotwe followed. The order that Basim and Hytham are pledged to destroy. Eivor, what has happened? Sigurd has been taken hostage, captured by King Alfred, and given to a woman named Fulke. A very dangerous woman. What does she want with him? I will spare you Fulke's ramblings, but know this. Sigurd did his part to secure an alliance with a thane called Gidrich. Gidrich is an honest man, and will come when I call. Until that time, Basim will locate Fulke. Look for his message when it comes. Have you spoke with Hytham about Vindland? I have. Good. I have marked it on the map with a bit of guesswork as to its location. Let me know when you wish to leave. Randvi, are you well? You seem distant. I'm fine. Only a little tired, but well enough. Shall we look at the map? Not until you tell me what is wrong. Oh, I think I have. I feel somewhat trapped. In this room, in this settlement, in this life. I cannot help you with your life just now, but... I can get you out of this room. I don't know. There is much work to be done. Stop. Forget about Alliance. We could take a ride. To Grand... That sounds lovely. And too far to get now. What what I want to see the Alliance map. The Chael Bet has traveled to Sherapshire. He has, into a difficult situation. The Shire has been mired in a long war with Rodri, King of the Britons. Chaelbert hopes to negotiate a peace with the Britons of the West. A difficult task for one so green. I hope your tutelage has prepared him well. Indeed. But I think it best if you supervise these talks. If Chaelbert can make this work, we will gain a val valuable alliance. I will make my way to Shirupsha. I am relieved. He and Ivar should be in Quatford just now. You will find it along the F and Hafun River. If Ivar is with him, I will certainly be needed. I should go. Look soon in.
Salve, Eivor. We have not yet been introduced. Quite a name, you... If you were wondering what good I will bring to the settlement... Yes, I have seen their great ruins. But you have not seen them restored to their former glory. Eivor? Why do you ask? I wonder if you know the feeling of having your very heart. I wonder if you have ever known the bitter agony of see- I have known such a pain. And Maximus? One of your lovers. Oh, God, no! He lost, I heard, Maximus. If you should ever see him, give him my regards. By that, I mean spit on him. Then recover my statue. I have to go. See you soon. Bonum fortunum in your travels, Eivor. I suppose it will do for the moment. Though it lacks the grandiosity of the Empire, it's me. You don't like it. Show me what lies ahead.
Stretch your wings, Sunan. Go, Sunan. Come raise a cup and lose it's some bad. silver! Oh, Come on, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Not half bad, boy. But be fierce, dirty. Strike at my boss. Ivar, are you training the boy or tormenting him? One will lead to the other in time. Eivor, well met. You received my message, and just in time. Our negotiations with the Britons have not yet begun. I will be at your side when they do. Is there anything I should know first? The venerable King Rodri is here. I am to deal with him directly. Rodri is desperate for peace. Ever since we captured his sniveling brother, Goriad. Sounds like a man coughing up snot. Goriad ap Mervin. Rodri waits at the church nearby. Who speaks for Shirapshire in these talks? The last elderman was killed in battle. 
Bishop Dayalov is standing in. Until we get this wet whelp installed. That is his father's wish. I find the idea of leading a shire on my own quite... quite terrifying. It is a grave thing to be elderman in the time of war, Gilbert. He will piss his pants first thing, that's for certain. As future elderman, you should speak in the talks as well. But with humility. Rodri is a king and will expect to be treated as one. Rodri will want us to get down on our knees and sniff the rosy wind blowing from his ass. I know the man. You've met him? Met him, fought him. He gave me this nick here. Maybe I can give him one back. Remind him some call me King Killer. It may be you should stay behind, Ivar. That is not a recipe for a good parley. I'd like you both to be there. To guide me, to judge my fitness. Give us your word, then. Your blade stays in its sheath. Eivor, don't make me laugh. We both know what my word is worth. But sure, I will let you do the talking. Probably. Excellent. Now, to the church, I think. Our guests await. It's not far, just across the village. We've been at war with the Britons for coming on two years. The Britons had the best of it. Tell me and my berserkers plowed through their ranks and chased Rodri's brother into a ditch. That's why Rodri's talking peace now. It's thanks to Eva. I am going to enjoy seeing him squeal, the old oak. Not nearly as much as taking him down, though. That would seal my legacy. Your legacy? As king killer. They do not all get away like Borgred did, Wolfkist. Keep the peace, Ivar. What has become of your preening brother? Oh, my brother. He parted. This road is unsure. You are better off leaving that sauntering pole in your wake.
Our Bishop Dealov and King Rodri are ensconced in the church ahead. These houses of Christ, they are all so hard and cold. Yet within is warmth. The Christian God unites King Rodri, Bishop Dealov, and myself. On his ground, peace will be made. Britain cowards, all of you! Captain Anil, explain to the good bishop our position. Yes, my sovereign. Bishop Dealov. We are deaf to offers of peace until Guriad is returned to us. The king's brother. The is... king's brother is a moldering sack of cow dung. You. I know your face, your stench. Ivar, the one they call boneless. Did I not gift you that scar myself? Ah, you did. And I mean to gift you a gash, you reeking piss pot, in your fat fucking skull. Hold! Both of you. My lord, this is Chailbelt, the future elderman of this shire and the son of King Chailwolf of Mercia. This green stripling? Elderman? You can piss without help, boy. Now, now, calm everyone. Good faith is all I ask. You know my demands. Until my brother Gwiriad walks free, peace between us is impossible. He is lucky he can walk at all. Fell on his own blade, fleeing from us. I will soon help you fall on yours. Husband, keep your head. It is in our interest to find a way to peace, all of us. First, my brother. First, your head on a pike. Then the runt goes free. Husband, no! Enough! This is a house of God. Let us take some few minutes to gather ourselves, shall we? Eivor, to me. I do not know you well, but Chaelbert believes you a steady head. We need such a one. It may be too late. I see the crows of war gathering. I have a hefty sum of silver. Speak to the people here. If the silver will help one bring us toward peace, offer it to them. Kannst du Herr Thora?